Lego wants to build its environmental legacy. The toy maker said Wednesday it was on track to replace fossil fuels used in making its bricks with more expensive renewable and recycled plastics by 2032. That's after it signed a deal with producers to secure long-term supply. Lego sells billions of plastic bricks a year. It said it aims to bring down the oil content in its bricks by paying up to 70% more for certified renewable resin. This is the raw plastic used to manufacture the bricks. Lego said it hopes the demand will encourage manufacturers to boost production. Lego's Chief Sustainability Officer Annette Stuber. And today we are pursuing uh, a road where we are using the mass balance approach, meaning that we are taking virgin fossil fuel out of the mix of, uh, of our materials and increasingly putting sustainable materials in, so that could be recycled materials or bio-based materials. CEO Niels Christensen warned the new approach means a big increase in the cost of producing a Lego brick though he did not give details about price or volumes. He said the company is on track to ensure that more than half of the resin it needs in 2026 is certified through an auditable way to trace sustainable materials through the supply chain. Lego suppliers use bio-waste such as cooking oil or food industry waste fat as well as recycled materials to replace virgin fossil fuels in plastic production. However, the market for recycled or renewable plastic is still in its early days. The lobby group Plastics Europe says around 90% of all plastic is made from virgin fossil fuels. Fossil produced plastic is about half or a third of the price of sustainable options, according to the world's largest producer of renewable feedstocks, Neste. Rival toy maker Hasbro has started including plant based or recycled materials in some toys, but hasn't set firm targets on plastic use. Mattel plans to use only recycled, recyclable or bio-based plastics in all products by 2030.